Let's play Pokemon's Word, Crown Tundra. If you guys missed last episode, it was actually a little bit ago that I recorded it. I don't fucking remember what happened. We were like on, we were, we were on. Guys, we, we were on. If you think we were off, you were objectively incorrect. We were very on. I don't know what the fuck that means, but I got a hard stone. Oh, we got a bag on. <laughs> He's on too. He's bag on. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me, Zub. Zubat, Zubat, excuse me, I want this. It's actually kind of hard to remember which Pokemon are like new to this, you know? Like I know that there's a lot of new Pokemon for the Crown Tundra. I don't know which are like new. I'm pretty sure Glalie was not in this. Neither was this thing. The hell's that called? I forget. I, I had one before in like a, a replay through of Pokemon Platinum, I think. The fuck's its name? Gla Glagger, Glagorice, um, probably. <laughs> it was Glagorice, and it would fall from Snow Run. I remember this. This mine now. Thank you. Fire Blast. Jesus. Does um, does Cinderace have Fire Blast? Is Cinderace even a, a special attacker? Cinderace, what you got, bro? You got the? Let me check summary. What do you have? I don't even fucking know. You have Blast Burn. Which is better, right? I mean, you do take- the user can't move on the next turn. So, okay. Interesting. Yes, understood. Oh my god, I forgot you could Gigantamax now! You have Pyro Ball, which is- Oh, you're probably a physical attacker, if that's like your move. 207 compared to- Oh, Yeah, I don't want you to learn Fire Blast, never mind. That's probably a very bad thing. Also, do I have Flapple on my team right now? Yeah, I do. I just like- Oh, it's 69! Nice, Flapple! We're very proud of you right now. I just, um, I feel like since we've been back to Pokemon Sword, I've not really, like, seen my entire team. <laughs> Maybe it's because they're tired of me fucking pushing them around with my fucking bike. God oh, damn. Does that Zubat want me? Because I'm not going to allow that. I'm out of here. Bye. I want this. I want this. I don't know if Zubats actually want to fight me. Like, it looks like they notice me and then try to charge my ass, which I don't like. There's a Golbat there. Did I just... The camera, like... What? What? Why? Why is there... That's weird. Why is the top of that textured? And why does it, like, tessellate only, like, the top portion of the cell? I have a feeling that might be, like, dynamic object later. And, like, it might break. I have no idea. <laughs> I guess we'll see. Put your votes in now, folks! Will that fucking happen or not? Where am I going? <laughs> I have no idea what's going on! Oh my god, a frost moth in the wild. Which actually puts into perspective exactly how small it is. Oh, I thought you were bigger than that, Frostma. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? I'm so disappointed in your girth. Get the fuck out of here, Snom. Why am I remembering Gen 8 Pokemon names and not Glalie, Glal, Glal, Glor, Glagger, Glagger, Glaggerson? The fuck's the thing? What's that name? I don't even remember that dumb name that I gave it previously. I like how there's Frostmoths out there that you'll never be able to touch. You can't touch them. Even if you want to touch those moths, you can't. They're off limits. Crown Shrine. What the fuck is go- Did I make my way to a place I'm supposed to be accidentally? Sure. I'll take it. <laughs> I was just aimlessly wandering, so okay. We're here at the Crown Shrine today, folks. The fuck we gonna see? I have no idea. Cool. Is something here? Something's breathing. And it has telescopic vision. That's weird. Nothing's here. The fuck? You felt that something was watching you until just a moment ago. Well, I'm gonna put my bet on the fact that there was something watching me, unless the cameraman was breathing heavily. <laughs> Which, you know what? Actually, I like that theory better because the, the, the fucking telescopic vision, my ass. You can't zoom in your eyeballs like that. I don't know what was actually looking at me. I mean, this is Pokemon, so I guess you suspend your disbelief enough to to, to believe that you're gonna... That psychic's actually a good move. I don't know, I might want to teach that to somebody. I'll see who can learn it, I don't fucking know. Um, you suspend your disbelief enough to think that there's actually all of these creatures about, strewn about, having a good old day. Where's psychic? Where's psychic at? Where's psychic at? I might already have like a half billion psychic TRs, I have no idea. What the fuck? What the fuck? Where is Psychic? 
This is the psychic fangs. What the fuck even is psychic fangs? I'm gonna go through all of this and I'm not gonna be able to teach psychic to anything. Yep. Okay, well, god fucking damn. Can I teach Aura Sphere to something? Aura Sphere. I wanna teach Aura Sphere to something. I just like the move Aura Sphere. I teach well, fine. Fuck you all, then. I was gonna teach it to Cinderace even after we just got through talking about how Cinderace is very much a physical attacker. I just really like Aura Sphere. It's probably just because goddamn Lucario is my favorite Pokemon. So, I don't know. Also, I really wish that I could... Okay, I guess this is a different load zone. That's fine. That... Oh, suddenly I can't control the camera anymore. <laughs> I forgot that you can't control the camera in this game. It's a luxury of the wild areas. Yellow. And when you're not part of the wild area, you better just not even put your goddamn thumb on that right stick. It seems to be some sort of basket. Really? I would have assumed that's like a brazier unlit. Okay. It's a basket. It's a basket. I thought there would be a mirrored basket. Okay. I'm a little spooked, if I'm honest. What is Clarison looking at? Is she like... No, she's looking at something. What is she looking at? There's something like over here. Okay. I'm a little, I'm a little bummed, cause I, I think possibly, probably gotta be VeggieTales, the fact that we are probably not supposed to be here yet, I don't know. I mean, it did trigger the weird wibbly wobbly camera. I don't know, man. Just kinda, okay, that's a wall. I was just kinda hoping, you know, that I actually did stumble into something kind of odd. I guess not. Damn it. <laughs> That's fine, I'll be on my way then. See ya. God, I wish you didn't have to wear this stupid bike outfit. Wouldn't that be nice? I would just be swell. Did I see what this was? Was it the Gotha Till or whatever the fuck? Whoops, whoops, don't wanna do that. Don't wanna do that, no, stop. Stop, stop, get me out of this, fuck. If I get noomed, it's calling out to people! What the fuck, I don't wanna get noomed to a goddamn battle with Goth Psychic. The fuck's the name of that Poco? I don't even know. Can I fast travel? I kind of forget if I can fast travel. Like, I could fly a goddamn Corviknight basket, right? Or something? Corviknight basket. <laughs> is this even the giant's bed? Is that even the Crown Tundra? No, this is still the Crown Tundra. Okay. I literally look into the King of Bountiful Harvests. Oh! What? And that's like north? Of this, where am I actually? Do I actually have a? Do I actually have a goal right now? Oh, I just really wanted to dick around. But okay, that's fine. I, you know what's really sad is I feel like we've dicked around to the point where we've actually seen the majority of this open world. I'm sure there's still something we've not seen yet, but I feel like we've probably covered the majority of the ground. Okay. Hey, I'm coming in, bro. What up? Oi, oi, chief! How goes the adventure and anything to report? Uh, the Legend of the King of the Bountiful Harvests. Doesn't look like you've got any fresh progress to report on this one yet. Oh, got anything else legendary you want to talk about? No? I guess this? Nothing, dumbass. Anything else? Uh, maybe the legendary bird? You've not seen shit! What else? I don't know, dude. Can I get some adventure hints? Which adventures got you feeling stuck? I guess this, I don't know. Ah, the legend of the King of Bountiful Harvests. This one's a head scratcher for sure. Make sure you've got a gander at that statue in town and heard everything the townsfolk have got to say for starters. Never hurts to open up your town map and check your legendary clue to take a fresh look for some, for square one either, from square one. Okay, all right. I guess, Never mind then, bro. I'll be on my way. Also, it's still calling out to other people. I'm pretty sure I'm not even online, though. Should I be online? I don't know. Can I? The statue of Pokemon. Someone feels like it's missing something. Yeah, I remember. Is this the house that Sonya said she was gonna be in last episode? Sonya, hey. How you doing, girl? Larson, how's it going? Gathering evidence. Yeah, about that evidence? Wanna check your progress? You found 2% still, dumbass. Does that mean there's seriously 50, per 50 different things? Also, I just skipped half of that dialogue, but I'm pretty sure she was just spouting nonsense. <laughs> Hopefully. I don't think I've talked to you yet, Sphiel Grandma. Orb, orb! Our village may not be the liveliest place, but 
do have a relaxing stay and enjoy the sights. I suppose there's not much to see besides that old statue, but enjoy that one sight anyway. I guess I probably wouldn't have gone in here then, right? If I've not even talked to that grandma. Is that a Cosmo? Is Cosmog like legendary or is it pseudo legendary? Or like not even, I have no idea, but okay. It's cold outside, dearie. Why not stay a while and get warmed up? Can I actually? Hey, what up? Do you like walking around together with your favorite Pokemon? Yes. Right, it's the best to try walking together all over the place. You decide to have your lead Pokemon walk around with you in the Crown Tundra. Oh, was that on a toggle that on and off? Why wouldn't you want that on? Also, that's kind of weird to have that locked away. Hey, have we talked? All the youngins and shit. Yeah, I remember you. I remember you. Spouting off about the youngins. So, okay, here's a place that I've definitely not been. Because I don't remember this dude chilling by this door. What up? Have you had a look at their statues of King of Bountiful Harvest? Yes! Is that all you've got to say? Yes! I've looked! What the fuck? Okay, baby. Still gotta look at that statue, huh? Like, I've looked. I've looked. Is there something back here? Oh, this is kind of cool. I like a little, little brush area. Sticker brush symphony. Good song, by the way. Spouting off about nonsense that isn't even <laughs> related to this game. Utility umbrella. Isn't, by its very nature, an umbrella a utility? You know, whatever. Dude, Dreadnought's slow as shit. I mean, sorry, Nomerson. Okay. All right, I guess the idea really is to just go fucking piss off, which is kind of great, actually. Like, I do like that. I just wish that this math, or this map made any fucking sense at all. Like, I wish that it showed me the direction I was currently looking, you know, so I could actually try to navigate my way to the fucking tree. I want to get to the pink tree. Grassland Pokemon's footprints. <laughs> That's what it said. Take my word for it, though. God damn. Um. Okay. Is there a stone yard or what up, buddy? Is there actually like a, a, a area that I can see that pink tree from? Cause I want to see that pink tree. I want to go to that pink tree. Nido King. Okay, stay the fuck away from. There's the pink tree. Okay. At least I have my bearings now. Espeon. Whoa. Hey. That's cool. I like it. I do like the wild area. God damn it. Like, objectively, probably the best improvement in Sword and Shield was the wild area. But I think what's disappointing, though, is that they just gave you a taste of what should have been the entire game. You know what I mean? Like, this should have been... This should have been exactly what Gen 8 was. The entirety of Gen 8 should have been just a big wild area. Like... Carve your own path, you know? There could still be routes labeled and marked, but like, make sure it's like open world the entire thing. I don't know. Also, I've definitely been here before. Oh my God, it's that one fucking greedent bastard that I accidentally got last time I went through that like one thing. Aerodactyl, what up bro, how you doing? That thing, I still don't know what the, what the hell's your name? God, it's gonna bother me. What's your name? Frostless. Let it be known. Let it be known there is not a delay. I did say its name before it came up on screen. <laughs> I did remember it. Speaking of Namerson being slow as shit, by the way, Namerson could not for the life of it fucking get out of this battle. I guess we're fighting our way out. That's fine. That's fine. We've not done like any fighting yet. There we go. Fuck you, Frostlass. Right in the frost ass. Got him. <laughs> you know, actually, I just realized that I, I was wondering why I didn't notice before that Namerson was so slow, like, back on the Isle of Armor. Oh my god, avoided the attack. We're just- this is- can I run? Can I run? Can I run? Got away safely. Maybe I should've actually finished that fight, Namerson would've leveled up. <laughs> yeah, we didn't have Namerson the entirety of the Isle of Armor. Like, I forget this. I don't know that I've seen Flapple out and about before. I feel like Flapple would be faster. Dude, Flapple's tiny as shit and slow. Okay. <laughs> Maybe faster than Namerson still. I don't know, but still slower than I'd think. There's a Glalie. Your counterpart, Frostlass, was eluding me for the longest time. At least its name, anyway. Goddamn. I, uh... Wait, I've been here? Okay. I did want to head down this way. 
I just wanted to go this way to see that that way that I just came from to see if there was like a dead end. But it didn't seem like it was dead ending anytime soon, so I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna touch every pink orifice I can, though. You better believe it. If you're glowing pink, I'm touching the orifice. There is so many stone yarners around here. Stone, stone, stone yarner. <laughs> I feel like I have to say it with like a dumb accent or else I'm not saying it correctly. Seriously though, and each one thicker than the last. Holy fuck. Okay, all right, it's fine. Can I, I might have to head like down river to even do this. Also, this tripped me up in the last wild area too. Like this river clearly, does it even have a, it has a very slow moving current. But considering the actual drop off here, like why didn't they, why didn't they make this more rapid looking like, you know what I mean? I don't get it. I also did not see that bar boat. All right, what up, bro? How you doing? Price, gonna need you to evacuate the premises. Thank you. Go, Flapple, go. Look at it in the eyeballs while we run away safely. Thank fuck. No more getting tripped up on the bar boaches. Yeah, I wanna go to that tree. I really wanna go to the tree. That's all I want in my life is to go to the fucking strawberry looking ass tree. There's a thing over there, but I couldn't, I couldn't even be bothered. I really can't. Balamir Lake. What was that? Oh, Corvusquire. Why am I remembering the names of... What is that? Normal type. I have no idea what that is. I don't know what that is. I can't figure that out. <laughs> God damn it. I, my first failure at who's that Pokemon, maybe even. I don't know. Tyron? Hey. God. I really like the fact that there are all of these new guys here. I mean, like, no shit. Corviknight, hey, what up, bro? Stay away from me, please. Thanks. <laughs> um... But yeah, I'm, I'm really, oh my god. I gotta go like, hi Bolton, how, how you doing? Bolton looks like he's missing something in his design. I can't place what it is. I don't know. It seriously, it might be down to the fact that he seriously does just look like a dog, but colored very awkwardly. I like his design, but goddamn. Th but saying you like Bolton's design is synonymous with saying you like the look of a dog. <laughs> Okay, stop, Bolton. Gonna have to ask you to stop being an asshole to me. Stop being, stop being an electric doggy for two seconds. Let me leave. Oh. oh, you're playing rough with my goddamn flat. Boy. I just want to run through. Got away safely. I knew R and Jesus would be on my side eventually. God fuck. Christ. Okay. Also, we're real close to that tree, but still, it feels like it's it's ever farther, and I know that I just passed up a goddamn sprinkle sparkle. <laughs> I just wanna get to the tree. I just wanna get to the tree. Here's the thing about this, is that it's very obvious that yes, the game is going to put you in a position where you have to go into this little open world, and you have to figure out exactly where you should find this stuff, and it's gonna leave that up to your own devices, and I fucking adore that, but realistically what it's asking me to do right now is to find very obvious points of interest um and this tree is very obviously a point of interest oh my god i didn't even know what the fuck that was that i was looking at <gasps> cute oh my god there's a literal dinosaur here excuse me coming through what the fuck's that guy's name tyrantrum that's probably it how did i remember tyrant's name right away but tyrantrum christ no idea what the fuck that guy's on about I wanna touch this. I wanna play who's that Pokemon again. I gotta redeem myself from earlier. Literal dinosaur, get the fuck out of here. I like Tyrantrum. Rock Bug, that's um, I know what he is. I just forget his name. Fucking Anorith Evolution. The fuck is his name? Ama, mom and drama center. <laughs> that's <not> his name. <laughs> That's definitely his name. Why is this episode the forgetful episode? I'm forgetting so many things about Pokemon. What is this? The fuck? Words are carved into this ancient tombstone. Spread my voice. Oh, okay. Well, there's this. Cavern Pokemon. That's 2% of that shit. Wait. That's only 2% of that specific thing? So are you saying there's 150 different things that I have to look out for? Oh. Okay. That's fine. How many Diglett were there in the last thing? Because I'm forgetting. I'm making my way though, baby. I'm making my way ever closer to that goddamn tree. <laughs> I like the fanfare. 
It's not that difficult to find this, these, these little footprints. Like, I've probably already passed up several, but like, whatever. Uh, hello? Are those apples on that tree? Okay. Am I just gonna get another fucking sniffing camera? Of the cameraman being absolutely sniffy? Wow, it's a big ass fucking tree! <laughs> That's what I imagine Glorison's internal monologue is. Oh fuck, it's the, the Moltres! Whatever the fuck. It's emo Moltres. Ah! <laughs> He's pissed! Oh my god, it's emo Zapdos! Why? God, why can't we be friends here? Why? Why are there so many emo birds? We're we gonna see emo Articuno. There it is! <laughs> what up? He's pissed. Okay. I really like the look of all of them. Oh, uh, oh God! Christ, shut the fuck up! My eyebrows are blue, and I just realized this. <laughs> Wait, don't leave. Let me fight at least one of you so I could get... I really want to get... Okay, he's fucking out of here. I want to get something... Okay, they've all headed to a... To a location. <laughs> cool. Cool. At least I sort of got to something done. Beep, beep, beep. Yes. What up? How you doing? Answer it, Glorson. Oi, oi, it's me, Peony. Peony? Is that a, yeah, that's what I said before. <laughs> Listen, I wanted to ask you something. Hang on, Chief! There's breaking news on the deli! They're saying Dodge Bird Pokemon are popping up left and right! There's this pointy feathered one in the wild area, plus a fiery looking one out in the Isle of Armor! And this fancy graceful one's apparently flying around the Crown Tundra! Wouldn't it be something if they turned out to be the bird Pokemon I wrote that clue about? Hmm, if that were the case, I think I'd call this expedition something like... Three? A legendary tray of legendary three! That's kind of stupid. <laughs> cool. Now I've gone and Ultra Mega completely forgot what I called you about in the first place. Well, life's too short to sweat the small stuff. Ta, Chief! Really? So I'm gonna have to go back to like previous areas? I like that. You jotted down the current status on legendary clue three. The bird Pokemon of legend. When the sun reaches its zenith, it shines directly down upon a great tree with leaves that seem to burn. It is there that the legendary wings come to roost. The bird of orange dashed off to the wild area. The bird of black flew off to the Isle of Armor, and the bird of purple set off across the town, Crown Tundra. Oh! Yeah, I hear you! Was that Articuno's cry? Okay, uh... Does that mean... It's here just somewhere, anywhere? It's like, how do I track it? I can, I can go maybe back to where I was earlier this episode because that's the direction it flew, right? So I went to this tree, Crown Shrine. Why not? I don't fucking know. I have a feeling whatever this is, is... Yeah, I hear you, Articuno, you crazy. Do I have to track it via its cry? Because I like that, but it flew off in this direction. Is he here? Are you here? Uh, I don't know that he's here. <laughs> Getting this sneaking suspicion he is not here. This is probably for like the the big brainy boy, which I forget the name of. You can't ride your bicycle now. <laughs> God forbid. Okay. So I have to track him in this wild area, I think. Yeah, his cry is coming from this way, I guess. Okay. Will I just see him? Is he gonna be here in this wild area somewhere? Oh, this is kind of cool. I like this. That's a frost mouth. You ain't the bird. You ain't the bird. You're an Absol. Get out of here. I'm looking for the fucking laser beam eyed bird. The hell's that guy's name from X Men who's got the laser beam eyes? Frozone. <laughs> Again. Just tack on to the forgetful shit. To be fair, in my defense, I've not watched X Men, I just know of it. Because it's popular enough to know of it. Oh. I... I don't completely understand how I'm supposed to track Articuno. Like, I suppose... I suppose it really does just come down to the fact that... Oh, this is precarious. I'm probably gonna have to, like, track him via his cry. But, like... Oh my god, Salamence, what up, dude? 
Don't mess with me. I just want this ball. Magmarizer! Why wouldn't I just get the fucking Magmar that's wild? I guess if up to this point I've trained a Magmar, then that's what I fucking... That's what I'd use on it. Okay, um, is this really all that's here? Oh, balls, this seems like a dead end. Yeah, it's dead ending, isn't it? Ally switch, well, that's fucking faint. Hey, sick. But that being said, I am going to fly the balls away because I am at a dead end. And I'm pretty sure I'm probably not actually going to be able to... to fucking do a thing from this area. Let me just fly, like, here, I guess. Slippery slope! I guess. I do like the fact that it takes, like, no time at all for me to... Wait, is he coming from in here? Is it seriously in here? Is it possibly in here? I don't know that it would be in here or not. But I swear to God, it was coming from in this cave, that cry. Is it not gonna... He's not gonna cry anymore. He's not gonna cry anymore. Okay, it, it was... Like the LR balance is going kind of nicely because I heard it in my left ear when I was facing the direction of the cave. It may or may not be in there though. I don't know. It's very plausible, I guess, that it is in there. Heck. Heckin'. I guess I'll... I don't know though. I guess I'll do it. Is it possible that I could see what the end result is? The thing is though, I don't even know the typing of our- What was that? Was that him? I swear to god I'm going crazy now. I think I just heard Articuno's cry. <laughs> this is actually driving me batty! I have no fucking idea! Oh my god. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Here. This is gonna be really stupid, but let me- Let me fast travel back to this that- that's right in front of me and listen to see if it's coming from in the cave. He's not gonna cry, is he? Ugh. Okay. Yeah, like I was saying, I don't know the type of Articuno. Like, I know that it's actually usually ice. Okay. Dynamax Adventure? Sure. Records indicate the last time you went on an adventure, you found Suicune. I noted where you found it, so you can try to take on Suicune once more. What would you like to look for this time? I. Any. No. No. Would you like to say. No. I don't wanna play that. I. I. I'm assuming that that is she would have told me if there was a fucking Articuno in there. Okay. All right, fine. I shall just kind of That's fucking creepy jinx. Did I have a jinx in my I think I had a jinx in my fire red let's play Did I even was it fire red or leaf green that I, I don't fucking know I don't even remember what the let's play I did was it was too long. Okay. Well that would have been death or a really fucking sick trick. Honestly, I kind of wish it just let me fling myself down that cliff anyway. And the fucking Articuno cries that I'm absolutely, at this point, maybe possibly imagining in my head. I have no idea. Articuno, you over here? Is it just gonna be like, is it just gonna like pop up in the, in the wild area, you know? I thought that that cry cryogonal might have been him. <laughs> Fucking scared the shit out of me. I have no idea how this works, and that's kind of exciting, honestly. Like, I I would like it if it did just like randomly pop up. I have a feeling it's gonna be in an icy area, though. You know, I really, really doubt that it's gonna be anywhere that's not like heavily snowy, because it's fucking Articuno. You know, you feel me? I really like the look of all of the redesigns. Like, I don't know if that's That's possibly <laughs> the, Hey, how you doing? I don't know if that's like a an uncommon opinion, but whatever. I have no idea, man I feel like we didn't really do a whole lot this episode, but like That Articuno, dude. I don't fucking know. I, I Have a feeling it's gonna like Kingdom Hearts birth by sleep my ass when I try to get the D-Link shit and um I'm probably gonna see it like in the corner of my eye while I edit. God damn it. And I'm probably not even gonna notice it. It's gonna be like right over here or something. You here, bro? I know you'll be you be doing your cry and nonsense. Is there a way? Can I like track it with the Pokedex like in other previous games? I really doubt it. I really doubt it. Can I like no. 
No, no, stop. I don't want to dig through this. Can I... Can I, like... Okay, yep. Crown Tundra Pokedex. It's not gonna be in here! Oh my god. I... You know what? <laughs> I don't know how I'm gonna track this thing. I assume... Oh my god, that scared the fuck out of me. What up, bro? Uh, that thing's fucking sweet. What the hell's that guy's name again? I don't even remember. Don't want to hit you. Don't want to hit a guy with my bike. God, these things are just everywhere. That's, um... He's cool. I remember Courtney had one of those. Um... Yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna find this thing. I assume... Maybe it's dumb that this is my assumption and I'm very wrong, but I, I have a feeling I'm just gonna kind of cycle around and he's gonna be there. I don't know for a fact that that's gonna work like that. But that's what we're gonna be doing next episode at this point. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this episode, please give it a like. If you want to subscribe to follow the remainder of the Let's Play, please do so. And also consider supporting me over on Patreon. Links for everything I just mentioned in the description down below, as always. <laughs> Thanks for watching and come back next time for hopefully us finding Articuno. I have no fucking idea.